Holy fuck, can I just say I fucking hate all of you? Every fucking time I'm searching for videos, I just get ass blasted with a torpedo of autism. Just fucking loud ass noises. I open up a video and it's like, what the fuck is wrong with you guys? Holy shit. And then your fucking audio in the actual video is never decent. I mean, I'm not the best at audio, but what the fuck? Get your shit together. Just show this is the disparity in audio. Now on the left you have her loud ass fucking music, and then on the right you have her speaking. Now mind you, the one on the right is abnormally quiet, and the one on the left is abnormally loud. Ten things you do not. What the fuck am I looking at? You have enough makeup on. You had enough makeup on 15 layers ago. Stop putting on makeup. What the, what are you? What are you? I feel like we're gonna be Naruto running in Area 51 and we're gonna discover a whole species of people that look like you. Say to an emo because it's fucking irritating. Number one. Well, that was a very obnoxious transition. Number one. You'd look so pretty if you didn't wear all that makeup. I don't fucking know that. You could look like one of the gremlins. Let's just say if I was hanging out with you and you ate after midnight, I might run the fuck away. The reason they say you'd look prettier without makeup is because it's the nicest way to say <coughs> without being all mean about it. There's not people lost my people A lot of people say this to me because of my eyeliner, like you can see. I, I like a bit of eyeliner. I'm like liking that. I reckon that's quite a bit fucking eyeliner, mate. And um, I'm naturally quite pale, so I don't even wear that much makeup. You lying motherfucker. Bullshit. You can lie to yourself, but you can't fucking lie to me. You're like Donald Trump saying this is just how his hair naturally is. It would be like Trump organizing a press conference and saying that that was his real skin tone. Guys, I'm just naturally orange. You realize you're not gonna get a job if you're an emo. This irritates me. I First of all, no one has ever said this to you. And secondly, don't classify all emos as your level of degeneracy. I know we shit on emos a lot on this channel because they're easy picking. When emos send people onto YouTube, they're not sending their best people, okay? They're sending shit posters. They're sending weebs. They are sending furries. They're sending people that make top 10 lists about what not to say to emo people. But most of them are good people, I imagine. Been working, my, both my parents own a business. Um, I've been working in their shops since I was 11. And I have got an interview next week for Superdrug. Well, let me get this straight. Your work experience for why you can get a job is your friends let you help out at their shop since you were young and you have a job interview. Okay. So. What are you talking about? So we call that an so... autistic emo spasm. And that's actually a sign that the emo is spreading to the brain. Be wary of that if you have any emo friends. <laughs> If I saw you out, I'd be really scared of you. That is one so many people say to me. Dog, that's not because you're emo. It's because you look like one of the aliens off of the Keemstar Storm Area 51 game. Do it now. Lick it good. Suck this pussy just like you should. Hey, everyone. What's up, bitch? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I will be reacting to Joey's World Tour ASMR because I did this yesterday. I have someone in the background right now. Imagine this. You and your friend are hanging out and you're like, hold on a minute. I have to go record a reaction video to Joey's World Tour Popeye's ASMR. Um, I did this um, yesterday. I posted the video. Um, it was reacting to a squid mukbang. So... You react to people eating. <laughs> As you all know from previous videos on my channel, I know Joey's World Tour. But what I don't know is this. Well, I'm sure you and Joey's World Tour would get along just fine. This amazing piece of art. Uh, this... Even the thumbnail is like... So... I just want to tell you, you three were made for each other. You two and Joey's World Tour need to collab. So Joey must have understood how much dignity he lost filming this and uploading it. Ew. Therefore, <laughs> he deleted it from his channel. But thankfully, the great souls of the internet have re-uploaded the video. So we can watch it. Now, someone on Instagram requested me to watch it. 
What? What? What the fuck was that? Why does everyone suck at making videos? What the fuck? It's not that hard. You just watch it. You're like, oh shit! I cut off half the fucking. I just cut off at a random point. Let me go back. So I'm gonna let her introduce herself. Hi, I'm a person, not an alien. Yeah. It's funny everyone who self-describes as a person or a human doesn't look like a fucking human. Remember when we were talking about the gremlins from the gremlin movies? E yeah. Great. And you should go subscribe to me. And yeah, I have 17 subscribers. Jalen Bradley on YouTube. Bye! Okay, well, I guess she's not gonna react to it, but no, I, I will. will. Oh, you will? Uh, yeah, I guess. I don't- I really don't want to, though. I'd rather, like, react to it like this. Hey, we don't need to hear the uncomfortable conversation about whether or not she's going to react to the video. Maybe do this beforehand or use that terrible jump cutting strategy that you did last time. I don't fucking know, dude. But you just posted cringe, bro. Okay. So I'm going to film this without audio again. Three, two, one. Okay. <laughs> did I mention I fucking hate all of you that make videos? Let's get started. Hi everyone, it's Joe from Joey's Super Cool Food Reviews. Hi! D don't, stop, don't do that, or I get fucking banned. I'm back. He's back! <laughs> no, I don't like this. Oh. I've watched other videos of him before. Today I'm doing... With her. Popeye's Magnolia Chicken. <laughs> it's Magnolia Chicken. I think it's gonna be really good. Don't you just feel like you're being molested through video? Don't you just feel like it's that time that your old Uncle Chuck took you around back and shoved his fingers where they weren't supposed to be? Because that's how I feel right now. So, check out to see what's inside. So check this out. So, I let's just look at this shot for a second. No, I, I don't think we're checking out any shot right now. I hate when people try to do what I do, but do it worse. So on that note, fuck this video. You know me, the fighting freak knuckles, and we're at Pumpkin Hill. You ready? I ain't gonna let it get to me. I'm just gonna creep. Down in Pumpkin Hill, I got to find my little speech. I know that it's here, rock a sense it in my feet. The great Emerald's power allows me to feel. I can't see a thing, but it's around somewhere. I'm gonna hold my head, cause I have no fear. This probably seems crazy, crazy. A graveyard theory. I ghost try to approach me and got leery. Ask him a question and he vanished in a second. I'm walking through valleys, crying pumpkin in the alley. Didn't seem happy, but they sure tried to get me. Had to back him up with a fist metal cracker. I'm hearing someone saying, You a chicken, don't be scared. It had to be the wind, cause nobody wasn't there. I searched and I searched as I climbed. 